Now, before we get started, if y'all can do me a favor and go ahead and like and subscribe to this channel, I would really appreciate it. James Harden still not traded. Um, there's a thing that happens when we get older. It's hard to accept our place in life now. At one time, James Harden was a very talented, sought-after player. That no longer is the case, of course. It's been difficult for him to find a team out there that's going to pay him what he wants. And at the same time, it's going to be beneficial to the 76ers. Um, now, I believe he's saying that, you know, regardless of what happens, he's not going to be at the 76ers training camp. Uh, he really doesn't want anything to do with the team anymore, which is cool. He has that prerogative. But, uh, man, the, the amount of snowflaking, of baby tactics, you know, uh, regardless of what happens, you getting the promotion or the raise you want, you have to go to work. And you have to work. We all have to do this. But evidently, once you start making millions of dollars, then you can be a snowflake. It's okay to sit out on the job because you're not happy at the moment. At this point, I really don't think uh, there's any redeeming qualities for, for Harden that could make me change. Uh, my opinion about him, but I think he knows this about the fans now and he's just you know trying to get a little bit of money I say a little bit of money a lot of bit of money before this thing ends and I'm, I'm trying to imagine what team out there would Won't harden at this point You know he can still he can still rack up some points. He can still put up some points but he can be a very lazy player, and when he doesn't want to play, he won't play. G good luck trying to find a team that's going to pay top dollar for you to be a diva. That's going to be it for this one, folks. Thank y'all for checking me out. I'll see y'all in the next one. Yeah.